Now, uh, a very large part of your game, 1,630 minutes in penalties, and not an awful lot of them were tripping penalties, uh, is that physical aspect. Um, when you're growing up, uh, I know you got older brothers and all of this. Is this where you honed your skills in this department? <laughs> or where did Wendell Clark learn to be as good with the Dukes on the ice? Is there off-ice training sessions that went on? No, not really. <laughs> not really. Um, I was always a physical player growing up. Uh, always played physical. We were allowed to body check right from the time we could skate. So that part was always part of it. I never really started, ha ever had an on-ice fight. Uh, my first actual on-ice fight uh, first three fights, uh, two first two were uh, a little guy with medicine hat, him and I were the same size at the time, and actually my third one was Bob Rouse in, in Lethbridge, and he was 6'2", 220 at the time, and that was a wake-up call, these guys are pretty big when you get up here, so uh, you had to learn um, in a hurry, and I always liked uh, defending myself, I didn't like it when somebody else uh, had to stick up for me, so uh, it was something that did be because you had fun at it. It was all being a part of now, playing Now, wait a minute. That's fun? Well, it's, it's fun it's, if you're winning. It's a one-on-one -on -one battle. <laughs> you, you win one nothing. You, you're fighting. It's, it's all part of one-on-one -on -one battles. Now, uh, one thing that you did, and I don't think I've ever seen anyone in the league, when you decided it was time, it was time. There was no discussions. There was no just quietly drop the gloves and stand back and get into the, uh, the John L. Sullivan mode. It was, here comes the whirling dervish in a big-time hurry. Well, it's, I didn't usually fight with a lot of defense, so it was get in there early and either uh, take one and give a, give a few and then and, and see what happens. Uh, I was never the biggest guy in a fight usually ever, so uh, just uh, an element of energy always moving forward in, in, in the fighting motion uh, seemed to do me best. Toughest fight you ever had? I don't know any of the toughest, but probably one of the longest in my younger days was uh, Ben Wilson in my first year. He was the uh, probably one of the reigning heavyweights in the league at the time. and. Uh, we had a fight in Maple Leaf Gardens and I remember it was a long battle and uh, we'd both taken a lot and given a lot. I was sitting in the penalty box absolutely exhausted. I didn't know how I was going to finish the game and I looked over at him and I didn't even know if he'd been in a fight yet. He was, he was well rested already and we just got there. But uh, he was a big, big competitor and probably one of the meanest uh, fellows I've played against on the ice. All right. Well, a little of the sidebar action of yeah. Wendell Clark's career as well.